voices in my head, they counsel me, they understand, they talk to me. I feel like I should capitalize on this because I'm probably going to be the first person to make a video about this. Um, on the, heat, on the heated debate between gay marriage, um, saying that the Supreme Court is finally taking issue about this, and um, they're going to decide on whether or not all 50 states should uh, legalize gay marriage. Because imagine Texas legalizing gay marriage. Whew! Um, there is this one person that gotten fired from his job for being gay. This is the entire video. A Charlotte Catholic teacher says he was fired for being gay. The church diocese says he can no longer teach after announcing his plans to marry his longtime partner on Facebook. NBC Charlotte reporter Michelle Bowden has the exclusive story tonight. Parents and students will tell you Lonnie Villard was a popular teacher at Charlotte Catholic for more than 15 years. The kids. Oh, it gives me, <laughs> sorry, it gives me goosebumps. You know, the kids are so amazing. He taught English and ran the theater department, was even named Teacher of the Year until deciding to scale back and work as a long-term substitute at the school a few years ago. And I got a call telling me that uh, I would not be allowed to teach anymore. Lonnie is gay. He and his partner, Rich, have been together for 13 years. Because I had posted on Facebook to my friends, Rich and I were going to get married this spring. Apparently, there were a couple of teachers that were unhappy with that. David Haynes, the spokesman for the Charlotte Roman Catholic Church Diocese, the organization that oversees Charlotte Catholic High, says Billard was fired because he went against the teachings of the Catholic Church. And heads will roll when you hear the reasons behind this. Well, the Catholic Church opposes um, uh, same-sex unions. Um, and there you go. Marriage can only be between one man and one woman. He's not being picked on because he's gay. He lost his job as a substitute peach teacher because he broke a promise. Which is probably the most ridiculous promise that someone can ever make. I mean, you can never change someone for who they are. Being gay is, is not some sort of crime. It shouldn't be a crime against humanity. It is something that it is completely and absolutely normal. People are becoming more tolerant and more accepting towards gay folks. And I'm surprised that even to this day, there are still people in denial that gay marriage should be legal. But apparently, God is far more important than anything. We need to stroke his fucking ego in order to make him happy. Otherwise, we're all going to fucking die, go rot and burn in hell for all of eternity because this God is nothing more than a freaking man-child because he chose to oppose church teaching. Yes, opposing church teachings for being who they are. And who they are is what something that the church can never change. You can never make a gay man straight and vice versa. Something he promised he would not do. The 68-year-old says most people at the school knew he and Rich were a gay couple. Rich often came to school events. The fact that I am in a long-term, committed relationship with a wonderful man is apparently abhorrent. But if I were in the closet, that'd be okay. And this is a really fucking serious issue right here. Apparently, you could be fired for being fucking gay. That is right there, discrimination. And yet this guy has the very balls to actually say that you're, you're not, they're not picking on this guy because he's gay. He chose to be gay. He chose to oppose the teaching of the church. Therefore, he has to be fired. Listen, I have no problem if you are gay or Catholic. As long as you don't push your beliefs on other people's throats. However, no one should be fired for who they are. By firing this guy, 
these people are making a very bad example on how the so-called Catholic Church is supposed to be loving and all accepting. It's ridiculous. Uh, that's my understanding of the church's position. According to the church, Billard wasn't technically fired because he was working as a substitute teacher and not a full-time employee. Back to you. Yeah, well, it doesn't really change the fact that he's being discriminated against because he is gay by the Catholic Church. I will be having more updates on this gay marriage war. Because, you know, it seems to be a trending topic right now. Until then, I am the Atheist Gamer. Peace the game out. If you enjoy watching this video, click on the like button, subscribe to this channel for more videos, and of course, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and ugh, Google+. We all know Google+, fucking sucks.